Ukpon Katamans have refused to bring down the red banners plastered around town in demand for social amenities, including free electricity. A meeting between the District Security Council and youth leaders on Thursday to discuss grievances that pushed hundreds of people to take to the streets earlier this weekend ended in a stalemate. <laughs> The demonstration on Tuesday was in protest against what the youth described as the failure of their elders to secure their interests. For example, they insist that they deserve to get free electricity supply from the Sonona Sogli power plant, which is located in the community. Thursday's meeting was called for the District Security Council, the elders and youth of Pune to discuss the issues for an amicable settlement. But proceedings did not go smoothly as most of the youth representatives staged a walkout. In the meantime, they have refused to bring down the red banners they have plastered around town. Uh, in the course of the meeting, I think some people thought otherwise that they are feeling heat. And a certain woman walked out, which is part of us at the meeting. So in a few minutes, we heard a lot of noise from outside. Those people standing outside, they are colleagues right now we did a demonstrating a demonstration with so they thought maybe something is going on there which is not right and upon coming out i heard so many of them with different voices saying the the woman have come to tell them that there should be a removal of the red flag in town and uh, in in the course of the uh, that or uh, hearing that it sparked the anger. So that's really what caused the anger. District Chief Executive Al Haji Isa Tete says the walkout was unfortunate. He is calling on the youth not to do anything to disturb the peace in the area. We we ad we advise that after all they have achieved their aim after hosting the red flags. Now that they have achieved their aims, we are pleading that in order to keep the town. You know, very steady. We wish that they will remove the red flags. They they didn't agree. All that they said was that they were going to meet their members and discuss the issue further. We didn't force them, so it shouldn't infuriate anyone. No, the, but the fact is, if they are saying that they want to be considered in job, um, you know, employment. I think it is a right demand. Every Ghanaian wants a job. The group is, however, threatening another demonstration if their demands are not met by Monday. 